Hi everyone, so yeah, as you can see, I'm on the last leg of the community challenge. So, wow, oh, this uh, this challenge was actually, wow, well, they're really out for blood, I guess, and it will really cause a lot of revive. So, yeah, my last leg, you know, we're just gonna just I have to buy this revive, the one that uh, we got from the calendar. I use it as well, so that was that was quite bad. Uh, Hyperion is one of uh, the more tankier Hyperion is one of the more tankier champions that can sort of outlast the cold snap so yeah hopefully we can uh, end it with this so after this video so we'll just take a look at the crystal opening as well and uh, <sighs> finally oh we're finally done uh, that took me uh, today is the second day after the event is released so after my last video the next morning when I woke up the chat group was like flooded with the uh, announcement for this so yeah it took me uh, more than a day to finish it oh, so we finally cleared that and uh, yeah it's a confirmed uh, 4 star of the following uh, champion so what I would not want would probably be things like uh Raccoon, uh, as mine is already awakened, uh, as well as Stark Spider-Man. The main two that I wish to get out of this crystal would be Mephisto or Iceman. And uh, Awakening Ant-Man would be great. Uh, Venom, Raccoon would be all the way down on my list. So, yeah, I'm just going to talk a bit more about the heroes that I would recommend using for this event so as you can see this is my team but uh, in my opinion I feel that uh, crossbone could actually be taken out for something else so yeah we just go in uh, the way I see the MVP for the whole game was actually uh, Hyperion cause it allows me to take out uh, Stark Spidey as well as Raccoon with full health as in he sustained damage uh, while fighting Stark however when we move on to Raccoon using his special one we managed to regain to full health uh, Mephisto was sort of the uh, bottleneck so I had to use Red Hawk as well as Stark Spider-Man to sort of clear it and when I move on to Ant-Man initially I thought that Crossbone would be a good matchup for it with the Fury stack and uh, ability reduction. However, it doesn't really worked out very well. So what in the end what happened was I had to use uh, Hyperion and with his power gain, I managed to do three special three on him without any Fury boost and that killed him. So uh, yeah, we move on to Venom. The amount of sort of buff that constantly stack was. Uh, really challenging initially I thought I could clear it with a uh, magic alone however even uh, as I was building to special 3 uh, after uh, power locking him for quite a while uh, I died so magic only did about like uh, half, half health on venom so after that uh, I had to finish the fight with Hyperion as well and after that as you have seen uh, I revived two, two, twice or thrice on Iceman alone so that was quite bad uh, some of my champions such as uh, magic uh, red hawk and stark spidey could not handle the cold snap at all so uh, even without dealing substantial damage to him they were he was they were already dead so uh, crossbone managed to pull through once where he managed to convert the sort of cold snap into fury but he only activated once so that, that was quite bad as well so yeah I had to sort of uh, bang through with Hyperion however we, using revive at 40% was um, seriously not, not enough yeah so the only way we could the, the only cheat code that we sort of have is yeah revive guys they were out for blood this one I mean it's a very good addition where they sort of get the content creator to contribute to the game but yeah, it was, it was, it was relatively hard. Yeah, and I saw some video where people take down Mephisto using Quick. I should have um, thought of that. 
yeah so as I was mentioning Crossbone might have been uh, a better character however that, that was the team I brought in sort of to counter Mephisto and as well as Ant-Man so yeah that's, that's what we had so okay glad to be done with that so we shall proceed with our crystal opening Yeah, so uh, Ant-Man would be the worst of my best choices that I would like. Uh, Mephisto or Iceman would be great. So yeah, I have some crystal to open here. Let's start with the Class Carries crystal that uh, got from finishing the uncollected from the X, the Savage Future event. So the best would be mutant class. Mutant class. Oh, look at all those mutant class. And okay, we got mystic, which is good since uh previously just up Domamu, so it's at zero. So that will bring it to one. And we have a four star to open. I uh, will just skip the three stars. I guess not much point in that so let's just open the four star and none really have no expectation here so we shall just see what we are landing on hmm. oh hood hood is great okay that 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 will bring that will be a new sort of character for my alliance war so we will have a sort of a full mystic team Okay, great. But I'm not sure sure how well he functions without being uh, awakened. So we'll take a look at that later. So for now, let's uh, let's open the Mat Five Crystal, and the uh, yeah, let's just see what we get from ten. Okay, so we didn't get any fully formed. Oh, still a long way away from my fourth tier four mutant class, so X twenty three would have to wait a quite a while to go to rank four. So we have our glory crystal. Wow, mistake again. They really want me to uh, rank some of them up. Okay, so uh, let's see. We have seven over here. Let's just open it. Wow, that that's just bad. <sighs> I have no confidence. Oh my god. Okay, so yeah, doesn't seem to have much more crystal that we can work with. So let's just let's just oh, let's just pray. Oh my god, Iceman of Mephisto would be the best. R really, come on, man, just. Iceman or Mephisto, please, no, no! Oh my god! It's like three consecutive of all the choices and do not want, and we spent so much on it, eh? oh my god! Oh my god, man. Oh, things are not looking good over here. Okay, fine. Oh, we shall just continue with the crystal opening. So this will be the final crystal for today. The 5-star crystal. Oh, what is this? Let's just take a look. Oh, I got a cosmic arena. I might forget it. So yeah, 5-star crystal. I mean, a 5-star hype. Period would be nice. Uh, Medusa would be nice. Mephisto. <laughs> yeah, man. Let's uh, let's just see what we're landing on. Totally, I. Why well, it was such a waste of that crystal just now. So what are we landing on? Ah, uh, you could have given me Gwenpu. Another mutant. Wow, I have I have a lot of mutant. 
I have Cyclo, I got Colossus, I got Cable, now I got Storm, X23. Okay, that that's just I I don't know what to feel about that guys. Yeah so Yeah we no more crystal for now. Uh, okay, let's just pop this open since they are practically useless. So, okay, so yeah, that's that. And yeah, so um, the first part of the video was talking about a few of the character I would suggest to use for the community rush challenge, and then we have our four star, five star, as well as the uh, community crystal opening. So, yeah, as you can see that. That didn't turn out well, it was semi kabam. I know some people might be complaining that I mean uh that I'm complaining because I got stuck Spider-Man, but it was really not one of the choices that I need or N1. So till now I'm still looking for Mephisto and Iceman to sort of add to my roster. So yeah, I would like to uh, remind that I have the a uh, hundred challenge with uh, my friend Filthy Casual so I've been doing a lot of the arena mainly to grind for the unis as well for the revives so yeah so we are at uh, what is this 27 so one quarter of the way there yeah and uh, we'll see you in the next video have a nice day guys